Now, here's a way to deter thieves and protect property in almost any situation. A trained dog is far more hazardous to crooks than dealing with an alarm. Our pet pro is here, though, with some important information on using dogs for defense. Beware of dog. You see the signs everywhere. People who don't even own a dog post them to scare off burglars. Of course, a lot more homeowners get the real thing. After all, dogs can and do provide excellent protection. When it comes to getting a dog for protection, there's one big question. What level is right for you and your family? There are three levels to canine protection. Level one dogs have no specialized training. They're family pets, and they can be any breed and any size. They react instinctively to any sudden changes around your home, alerting you to someone walking up to the house or a noise you may not even hear. A level two dog has the ability to bark, growl, and bare his teeth on command. So let's see you get Tosco bark on command. At home or on the street, if you feel threatened by someone, you can fire a canine warning shot by getting your dog to act aggressively. Most people quickly back down. Level three is where things get serious big time. These dogs will not only alert you, bare their teeth, and growl on command, they're also trained to bite and hold an intruder until commanded to release him. When I was on the Air Force One canine detail, I worked with a German Shepherd named Chuck. A German Shepherd makes a particularly good protection dog because of his natural tendency to want to protect his family. German Shepherds are easier to mold into the right dog for you. Training never stops when you own a level three protection dog. If you don't have the time or inclination to train and maintain your dog's skills, then a level three dog is probably not for you. Keep in mind that you are liable if your dog kills or injures someone, so you definitely want to weigh the benefits of having a protection dog with the risk that they bring with them. People get dogs for all kinds of reasons, and protection is definitely a big one. If that's important to you, be sure to do your research. You may just find that a lovable level one dog is all you really need or want. I'm Luciano Aguilar, America Now. That's a good boy. Luciano, what if you need a dog right away? Time is of the essence, and you've got to have a trained guard dog that's ready for duty. If you have an immediate security threat or concern, and I hope you never do, there are professional dog handlers that can match you and your family with a fully trained level three dog. But it can get expensive. It can cost you anywhere from ten to $85,000 for that dog. Oh my gosh, wow. Thanks, Luciano.